My name is Filippo Conforti, and I'm the founder and CEO of Commerce Layer, which is an enterprise-grade commerce API for developers. Before founding Commerce Layer, I've been lucky enough to work with some of the best brands in the world, especially in the luxury industry. And today, I'm, go I'm going to talk about that, about luxury, and how Headless can be considered the new luxury. Before getting into details, let, let's answer this question. What does luxury mean? What, is it, what does exactly the term luxury mean today? Are we talking about this? Well, this is very funny, but we are not, we, we are not talking about this kind of luxury. The definition of luxury has evolved a lot in the past years, from luxury as a product to luxury as an experience. So the old way of defining luxury was about buying expensive, extravagant, and very often superfluous product. And today, instead, it is all about experiences that have to be authentic, personalized, and unique. This is how millennials are thinking about luxury. And this is why we are talking about the new luxury, because the term has been redefined by them. So how can we help brands create luxury shopping experiences for their customers? Well, as you may guess, the answer is uh, headless commerce. Headless commerce is an e-commerce architecture in which the front-end layer is decoupled from the back-end. In the traditional uh, approach, everything was provided by a single monolithic platform, you know, the back-end and the front-end layer. With headless commerce, the front-end and the presentation layer is separated from the backend that provides all functionality and data through the APIs. So we have two different approaches, two different work workflows. Let's take a look at the first one, the traditional one, the monolithic workflow. When you build e-commerce with a monolithic workflow, you start by selecting an e-commerce platform. Then you design the website, you try to integrate the design into the platform, you set up the infrastructure with databases, application servers, load balancers, caching layers, a CDN, and you try to make your website as fast as possible. As we can see from this workflow, everything, everything starts from the technology, because you start by selecting an e-commerce platform that dictates also the following steps, especially the design and creativity. That's why monolithic is not luxury, because it gives you you know, and especially creatives, a lot of constraints and, and on, on the creativity and the flexibility so that integrating the design into the platform becomes really cumbersome and very hard and costly. Let's take a look at the headless workflow instead. The headless way starts by designing the customer experience. Then you build the website, maybe using a static site generator if you, if you work on the jam stack. Then you add, you add headless content choosing a best-of-breed headless content management system. Then you add the headless commerce platform like Commerce Layer to make that content shoppable. And then you deploy everything to a CDN to make your website fast, scalable, and secure by design. Unlike the monolithic workflow, the headless way starts from design, from the business aspect of your, of your project, you know, so that you can really focus on the customer experience first. And then you can build a pixel-perfect website. You can add a headless CMS that lets you design the content model as you need. And you can make that content shoppable through a headless commerce API, like Commerce Layer. Visit our website at commercelayer.io slash gemstack if you want to learn more about this new approach of building e-commerce on the gemstack and grab your free copy of our white paper. Uh, what is Commerce Layer, anyway? Commerce Layer is an enterprise-grade commerce API for modern developers. It is a pretty extensive set of APIs that cover everything you need to build e-commerce on the Gemstack, from inventory, prices, taxes, checkout, payments, orders, shipments, fulfillments, and much more. Building e-commerce with Commerce Layer is all about building a best-of-breed architecture with Commerce Layer at the center. The first step is to import inven inventory into Commerce Layer from a PIM or ERP or any other system that you may have. That can be also a spreadsheet. Then you may want to integrate a headless CMS and to make the content and the commerce part integrated through the, through, through the synchronization of SKUs. So this is a very important part of the stack because 
Unlike many platforms, Canvas Layer doesn't manage any kind of content, neither the catalog related product content, the product information, the taxonomies and all that kind of stuff. We really believe that all content belongs to the headless CMS, to the content management system in general. The only link between the commerce part and the content part is the SKU, which is the shared identifier of your products. So starting from the headless CMS, content editors can really uh, manage the content uh, without having to deal with the transactional aspects of commerce. Then, using a static site generator, developers can fetch the content API and build and deploy a beautiful website that will be delivered through a CDN. From the edge, the content and the website can be made shoppable through Commerce Layer API. And then, for sure, you can also integrate other APIs to enhance your experience and to make, you know, to add more integrations to Commerce Layer or any other system. This is an example of this stack with some of the best players in the market. So SAP can be your ERP, for example, which is the, you know, uh, where the inventory comes from. And then you may want to use Contentful to manage content. Nuxt.js as the static site generator, the front-end framework. Everything deployed through the fantastic Netify. And then you may want to add Algolia to the stack in order to make your search experience really outstanding. This is one of the stack that many of our clients are using today. The good news is that all components in this architecture can be swapped with others. We are talking about composable commerce, meaning that you can take one service or tool and replace it with some other service or tools that maybe, you know, fits your need, needs even better today or tomorrow. So, for example, if we take Contentful, if we take the headless CMS, you can replace it with other great options like Dato CMS, for example, or Graph CMS or Sanity. So this is a really flexible stack, flexible composable stack that lets you build headless commerce the right way. Some of the leading brands have already embraced the headless commerce evolution and are already providing luxury experiences with headless commerce. Brioni, for example, who is one, which is one of our clients, a selected Commerce Layer, Contentful, and Algolia to build a truly omnichannel experience for their clients, and their website is outstanding with an, an immersive customer experience. Another great example is Chili's. They selected Commerce Layer and Data CMS and really created a beautiful website on the Gemstack. If you want to get more examples, or if you want to, you know, if you need our help to build your next project please visit commercelayer.io and get in touch. In the meantime, I will be around to answer any questions that you may have in the live chat. And um, yeah, that's it from me. Uh, thank you so much for your attention and uh, enjoy the event. Bye-bye.